What's going on everybody? Grim Repair here. Today we're going to be changing spark plugs on a Toyota Corolla. There will be links down below to the parts and any special tools needed for the job. If this video helps you out, be sure to give it a like. First thing you're going to do is pop the hood. Remove the negative post on the battery just to make sure you don't short anything out. We're going to be working with some electrical. Next we're going to lift this cover off. It just pops right off. We're going to squeeze these tabs here. These are the coils. Underneath is the spark plugs. And pull off these electrical connectors. And I'm just going to show you how to do one of them, but they're all right here. Procedure's the same for all four of them. Now we're going to take a 10 millimeter socket, loosen up this bolt, set it up here, and the coil is going to lift out just like that. Rubber part here is the boot. You should replace this and the spring inside every time you do a spark plug. There's also a seal up here you should replace. And make sure they're the same. this seal off on the top notice how it uh, how it goes flat side goes toward the sky boot is just going to pull off. There's the spring. Notice how the spring is situated. Smaller part goes toward the sky again. Take the tape off and just pop it back on. like so. Next we're going to remove the spark plug which is down in there. I'm going to look down in there make sure there's not a bunch of oil in there. If you got oil getting in there then you need a new valve gasket, valve cover gasket. You got to remove the valve cover to do that but you want to check. All right we're going to take a 14 millimeter. I do not have a 14 millimeter spark plug socket. We're going to move the cowling out of the way, slide it down the tube and we're going to loosen it up. All right, once it's loose, we're going to pull the socket out. And then we're going to use an old coil boot, slide it down there. We're going to grab the spark plug with that. And it's out. You do not gap these. Gonna pull it out, slide the new one into the coil, and get it started in there with the coil. Now we're gonna put that back in there, tighten it back up. I'll put the manufacturer torque spec somewhere here on the screen, but it's usually hand tight and then about a quarter turn after that. Feels good. Now we're going to put the rebooted brand new boot coil back down in there. Tighten that back up. Plug it back in. Then you're going to do the other three the same way. And we're going to put the cover back on, hook the battery back up. And that's it. You'll be done. High five. You did it. Thanks for watching.